Hey, what's going on guys? Just wanted to say I'll start off by showing you a few of my servers. You're more than welcome to join. This one's whitelisted, this one's not, this one's not. A little warning before you go ahead and join this one. This one has world edit and a bunch of other features. So you can't really destroy other people's property or, you know, troll somebody or anything. This is the one you mostly see our YouTube videos on. Oh god, that cat and the lag. But yeah, anyways, you see me and Andrew and Richie. That's, you know, their real names. Other no otherwise known as A and uh, Durbin. Yes, you can tell I'm a little nervous because I really do not like solo play, you know, commentary and all that. So. I'm a little nervous right now, just trying to get over it. But yeah, um, just wanted to, you know, give a video out, explaining everything, how I got started. Uh, well, I'm a big fan of BWO, Etho, Dokium, Good, uh, most of the other ones, you know, Zisto, Milvi. Subscribe to all of them. If I left anybody out, I'm sorry. But yeah, uh, I never really liked the YouTube thing. I've had my YouTube channel for, you know, quite a while. I mostly used it for commenting on videos, you know, subscribing, keeping up with everybody. And, you know, I, I said, the hell with it. I'm, I'm going to start my own YouTube. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to record videos. I mean, I'm just getting started, and, you know, my videos aren't going to be too good of a quality. Uh, yes, I am southern. I'm from Alabama. Uh, don't really like this place. <laughs> but uh, this is where I live. This is how I sound. You know, we're all humans. You know, you can like my channel, not like it, whatever you want. You know, I just started. It's whatever you want. <laughs> but what I'm going to do is I'm going to chat and I'm going to show you a few things around here that you don't see in our videos. Most of our videos are about the building and most of the other stuff. I don't know how long I'm going to go with this video, but we're going to start off with a skelly spawner. I found this, uh, I think I was just digging down, just trying to find some iron and some resources. Uh, oh, yeah, another thing about this server. We do use cheats from time to time. Uh, mostly for teleporting, you know, finding, like, like Durbin, like a video I put up, he found a temple. Yes, I cheated. I teleported to him. I used creative mode to show it off. That's only because he was a venture. He is on an adventure to try to find a mushroom island. So, big props to him for doing that. He's trying to find it. Hope he does. That'd be awesome. These are, you can only get in creative mode. So, I kind of put these here as in you know a little show it's my server it's my youtube channel i do whatever the hell i want <laughs> but yeah we do use cheats but you know everything on here is legit we get everything you know legitly um we build legit the only time we ever use cheats is like maybe from time to time to teleport like i said you know nothing too major building or anything like these I got this all legit. I found this and I dug this out. Hell of a fucking thing to do. So, yeah, that's the skelly spawner. Um, about my servers, you know, there's lag from time to time, but I'm with Cubed Host. I think B Double O used Cubed Host for a little while for his server. I will get to that because that's a long trip. But, um, oh, this is my mine shaft. Right here is a slime chunk, I think. I think it goes all the way around. It's a pretty big chunk, but this is the one I've seen them the most in. There's none right here, but you will hear them fapping, believe me, and it gets annoying. Down here, uh, Doc M released a tutorial. I don't remember who the original maker is of this. It's, uh, case fire farm and what it does you know it spawns the spiders turn off the lights 
open that, they go down there, you know, you go down there and crush them, you've probably seen that on one of my other videos, but this is full on, you can see it. Uh, enough of that. I'm just kind of, you know, shortcutting through this video. I don't know how long I really want to make it, because it takes a hell of a long time to render all this. This, you may recognize this from one of our, I think, the second video about the creepers. Right down there is where we died, and I laughed my ass off about it. Uh, haven't been here in a while. Uh, and I do use mini map. I know it's everything's not vanilla, but you know I've always used this, these things. So I figured, you know, it's not really a big deal. No one really cares, really. Like Richie, I just got him to use mini map. This guy I found the other day, well, last night. Found him frolicking around somewhere in here. He was a zombie villager, so I just kind of uh, cured him, and now he's my little guy. Cool thing is, I use this the most. This is like, you know, my place for fits and weapons, coal, iron, all that. Cool thing is, check that out. I already got him up to. to ooh, I haven't got that yet. Man, I'm gonna make him happy more. I don't have that though. I got plenty of saddles. But yeah. Found him. He's a blacksmith. Awesome. Of course, perfect. I am using Deathscape uh, texture pack. This is my brewery room. If it wasn't obvious. <laughs> Nether hub. The most painful thing I have ever done on this server. Andrew did most of the work. I won't lie. I did this on my own. This is to keep, you know, mobs if they come through or, you know, I'm trying to run away from them. BAM! Go through here. <clears throat> and it leads us back to the main nether hub. That's tricky as hell the way my portal works. So you go down here and you go to Richie's. I'll have to show you that at a later date because I'm trying to keep the episode a little low. Um, Yeah, go back through there and it leads right back to my portal. Go show you the village. You must have, you might have saw in my uh, little lair. There's a tunnel leading there. This is the shortcut. <laughs> my tunnel leads to two cave sp spider spawners. They're dual, which was awesome, and a zombie spawner. Oops. This is keep villagers from getting in. This we created. We wanted to find a spot to make a village and. We pretty much just went with it. I built the village here. Andrew uh, was converting the villagers. I think there's currently six here. I'm not sure. But I did all this. Nothing fancy. They all seem to like to hang out in the shit house. You'll see an episode come up soon about it. I think it was on that episode. I'm not sure. We may have not been recording. But we convert them in that little hole over there. I was actually exploring last night. And I did not know this until now. Over here, it looks like a ravine. I wanted some iron. Like I said, I've been looking for iron. I want to try to finish that track to Richie's place. And all that. And this whole time, we've been around here gathering trees and, you know, looking around. But I never thought to come down here. I wanted some iron, like I said. So I came down here searching for iron. Get the hell out of here. And I was like this, and I was like, wait, 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 what? A zombie spawner. No way. Out of nowhere. And I got a gold record. I was like, hell yeah. So I kind of been on a binge for records here lately. I got two more. Uh, they was creeper kills from a skeleton. So... I think it was chirp and some other one, but ow! I get three records now. Go and try to get more. Don't got a record player yet. Go find diamond.
I've been hurt for some diamond too. But yeah, very nervous. Just want to put this video out, show everybody. But my channel has just started, and we're on the ninth episode. Those videos will come out soon. I'm not sure if this one's gonna come out first, or you know, if it'll come out after. Just depends on how fast I can render them and put them on YouTube. Uh, get away from that hole. Put that back. And we're gonna go sleep so I can show you Andrew's place. Like I said, I had to show you Richie's place in another episode because it's far, far away. We don't even have the track, not even close to his place. So it's gonna take a while to get there. And I really don't have speed potions to get there yet. I had some, used them all up. But going to show you Andrew's place. My enchantment room, nothing fancy. I'm the type of guy, I'm kind of like Etho. I like underground building. I like making man caves. I like building underground, making bunkers, catacombs, lairs, and all that. This, uh, close as that. You know, in case, you know, I don't know, it's just cool to have. But this was my original house. I made this, you'll see it in the first episode. I made it off camera. A lot of my builds are off camera. Because like I said, I'm, I get nervous whenever I do, you know, solo, let's plays and all that. Which I'm trying to get into more. Like this episode, for example. But, yeah, this is my original place. Then I decided to cower down underground. That's the nether hub. It'll lead back to where you saw me first come out through my portal. Kind of lazy with my gardens and crops and crap. A little beach. Gotta get this cow back over there. I found that cow. I felt bad. I almost killed him. So I'm not gonna kill him. And I'm I'm a big fan of doing pranks. I saw a, on the Minecraft they do a lot of pranks, and I kind of got into it. You'll see this and be like, "What the hell?" Another creative mode thing. Uh a lot of people don't haven't started using them since the update. So I figured I would troll Andrew a little bit. And I put a bunch of them around. <laughs> so let's go up here to his brewery. You know, pretty cool place. This, you saw in one of the videos. Cool idea. Big props, Andrew. I still haven't seen that yet. I need to go look at it. Uh, crops. Cool little storage room. Kind of like mine. My idea came from Etho's videos. He has this little storage room that he has. Double chest embedded into the wall. So I decided I'll kind of do my own idea with that. Oh, it takes a long time to travel on here. <laughs> uh, I did say I was going to do a shorter video. I guess it wouldn't be too much if I did show you Richie's place. Andrew came up with this idea. Cool idea, too. Uh... <laughs> Keep things from going in, keep things from going out. Oh, I forgot I need to um fix this. I was trying to <laughs> I was trying to um get a pig to go through a portal. So I can have one underground, I can travel a lot faster. That didn't work out too well.
I'm not going to show you Richie's original place because it's nothing but a big ass hole in the ground. I kind of been working on the rail a little bit down in my mine shaft, gathering rail. Uh, I found another mine shaft that was the tunnel leading to uh, the the village. So, like I said, I use creative mode and cheating a little bit. I don't use it a lot though. For this purpose, I will. Uh, kind of made a few mistakes like that block that was back there. So we're just going to travel a little bit here. No, I had a lot of views on my channel and I only have one subscriber and that's for my friend in real life. Like, like I said, I'm doing this video to let y'all guys know. What was that? I know that sign was on the other side. <laughs> Yeah, uh, Richie put shut up Sheldon because I put a sign there saying that I liked the idea of that being in these. And I said, uh, blow me or let a creeper or something like that. And I guess he came back and put that. <laughs> I did a prank on Richie too. Uh, he needed a bunch of wool, so in the midst of gathering string from my spire spawner. I was trying to get some level ups and all that. Um, I made wool out of all of it. And I took it to Richie's place and put it in his enchantment room. And uh, he needed to teleport back from his adventure so I teleported him back to his castle and went there to see him. Look at his prank. It was pretty funny. We got a nether, nether fortress too, uh, thanks to uh, Richie. He found it. Like I said, this is a long walk, and if I would have done it without creative mode, it would take ages. Here we are. I'll show you the nether fortress. I haven't really done much over here. I think I got some blaze rods and stuff like that. You know, I haven't really explored it. I think they have. I have it. Dual blaze spawners right there. But that's for a later date. We're only on episode 9 currently. So we got a good while to go. We will be fighting the uh, dragon. He, we call him 3D, cause Dirty Dick Durbin. I call him Richie. He calls me Sheldon. I mean, yes, my name is Sheldon in real life. His name is Richie in real life. And Andrews, Andrew, you know. This is what he's currently working on. Uh, some kind of wizard's tower or something. I really don't know. It's pretty damn neat. It's all done legit. He's worked his ass off on this. Get in there. Thank you. I still haven't figured my way around this place. Like I said, he needs wool for this, I guess. But yeah, I put all the wool here. It was just plain white wool. <laughs> it's covered all in here. I think it was maybe two stacks. Two anvils, Jesus. I would really like to see what happens in the future with this. Which way is... I guess it's this way? I'm not sure. I think it... yeah, because I remember jumping over that. Oh, what is this? Oh, we don't need this. What are you doing, villager? Get the hell away from here. You're going to burn. I guess we had a thunderstorm over here. Or maybe the damn nether rack. I'm not sure, but 
Andrew and Richie created this as an artificial village. Uh, they have been breeding. Uh, my villagers haven't. I don't know why yet. I'm probably doing something wrong. I'm not sure. Nah. Nothing real special. Not that it's not special. It's just, you know, regular village. <clears throat> but yeah, that is pretty much it right now. You know, as far as everybody's stuff and... Um, me rambling on about random crap. But, I mean, if you like my videos, you know, let me know. I mean, don't put anything hateful or anything. You know, I'm just a regular guy. I have a regular job. Like I said, I'm a big fan of Etho and all of them. My f main favorites are Etho, B double O. I like Etho the most. Sorry, B double O. Love you, dude. Ah. Uh, I just, I don't know, I like Ethos videos, he's really cool. The redstone stuff he does has helped me out a lot. Uh, I think I got a creative world where I mess around with some redstone contraptions. Doc M, now he does some pretty neat stuff too, like the spider spawner, I thought that was cool and I found that case spider spawner and I was like, shit, <laughs> I'm gonna turn this into what Doc M did. But yeah, I mean... What the hell? Oh, hassle. I thought I froze for a minute. Uh, since we're halfway there. Uh. I said I was gonna make this a shorter video. What the hell with it? Um. I'm gonna stop right here. I'm not gonna stop recording. I'm just gonna disconnect. Uh, I will be switching over to IPs, maybe, I don't know, but this is public, like I said. Um, let's go into the past a little bit. This is our old server from way back. It's a private server. Me and Andrew, was, this is legit, all legit too. Uh, this is one we played on for the longest time, I think it was 1.3.1. Or something like that. I really don't remember. I don't keep up with the updates. Uh, nothing really special. We haven't got that far on this server yet. I don't even remember a lot of this stuff. And that's our storage room. This is my old place. had a snow golem down here somewhere. I don't know where he went to. But the biggest project I worked on was way over here. I just kind of went off in the distance. This is a cool little thing I did. I love Skyrim. So I just kind of, you know, for the people that did join this that you know we allowed like say if Richie was to come on this private server put a bunch of random crap you know uh, you know their stuff I looked up on the Skyrim wiki what their things was like Mara's that love or something another reason why I named the village on the uh, public server the Moorcraft server Mara cause we built that village out of love but I'm kind of like a monk in real life, you know. I, I kind of get social anxiety a little bit, and I'm kind of like that to a certain extent on everything, video games and all that. That's my portal. This is a legit, like I said, big, big plan. I've done bigger builds and everything but this is just enormous I did not get any ideas from anybody I just kinda went with this all legit
<laughs> Dawnstar. Skyrim. Yeah, that wasn't too long ago that I built this. You know, once the new update came out, we just... I reset the servers and went to a new map on everything. Main reason I built this, good timing. The uh, sunset. I'm not going to show you down there because it ain't really nothing special. And for some reason, stuff still spawns. I do not know why. Why is this doing this? Oh, okay. Alright, weird. I don't know if you'll see that or not. That's pretty much it on this private server. I don't know why that is doing that. Going to my testing world. Yeah, I was playing around with the witch. I do a bunch of random stuff on here. This is where I test all my builds and etc. and all that what I wanna try out thinking about whenever we get one of those doing it that way but underneath this this is iron it's just one tier <laughs> messing with slimes over here block pusher and just keeps pu pushing it just some random shit I do. This I was working on, um, you s see it on my video now, the one I'm recording. My nether thing. Sentries. They don't survive. Too bad. This is, I think, a design by B double O. Some little contraption he did. Or, you know. One minecart goes this way and another. Ah. Uh, be right back. One second. Okay, I'm back. Wrap this up real quick. Just show you this. Nothing special. I may incorporate this design at the spawn area on the build server once I get a lot of nether rack and all that stuff. <laughs> Romasa. Terraria. But yeah. Like I said, you know, if you like my stuff, just, you know, leave a like subscribe whatever you want to do you know give me some feedback I try I'm a regular guy well I guess that's it see y'all later